What is up, guys? Strategist 420 here, back with another episode. This is episode 3 of Spaceborne 2. Uh, last we left off, we just dropped off our robot. This is the final boarding call. I think his name was Simon. So, he wants us, he gave us a job offer, so I don't have to. I don't have to pay to get my robot fixed, since it was 50 years old, at least. Uh, he needs us to check out the laboratory to find his friend. Because he lost contact with him. So, came from up here. Sarum? It's a target. Landing gear, deployed. landing gear retracted. Calibration module activated. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thrust to end.
shit. supposed to be flying. Calibration module activated. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thrust to be I'm still confused. All right, let's jump back. Calibration module activated. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thrust to activate.
signal found in the system. Weapons online. Weapons online. You can enter the planet directly by ship. However, this takes you to an estimated point on the planet's surface. If there is a specific place you want to warp drive offline, warp drive online, weapons online.
piloting a ship you can enter the planet directly by ship. However, this takes you to an estimated point on the planet's surface. If there is a specific place you want to land, first activate the warp drive with the big key while in planetary orbit. Oh shit. Calibration module <coughs> activated. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thrust to complete. Calibration module activated. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thrust to complete. You can enter the planet directly by ship. However, this takes you to an estimated point on the planet's surface. If there is a specific place you want to land, first activate the warp drive with the big key while in planetary orbit. Then lock on where you want to go. Finally, boost thrusters and enter the atmosphere. Every signal reverberates in space. To find the signal, we must track these echoes. We use catcher probes for this. You can enter the planet directly by ship. Warp drive online. There we go. The surface align process is completed, waiting for the thruster input. Something wrong. Check Coran's lab. <coughs> These are Coran's men, and I'm sure they know you're here. You don't stand a chance against the mercenaries of Corans with their equipment of yours. You need better equipment. I know where Coran hides his stash. Let me show you.
seen drop ships approaching your area. Get ready. took him down to the research center in the cave. I know I'm asking too much, but would you go to the cave by elevator and check it out? This shit's not toxic to me. <sighs> yes. Dead. How? Damn it. I told him not to mess with Quirk. Wait a second. Do you see any AT documentation around? It should be in a small mechanical box. Damn. It must not fall into Quinn's hands. Fortunately, we had a tracking device attached to the AT document. Just wait a sec. All right. I know I'm asking a lot from you. The Quorum stole the AT document and is about to leave the atmosphere. You must catch him immediately. According to my screen, there's a cargo ship directly overhead. The AT document must be in a container on that ship. Please don't let them escape.
the atmosphere, we lose it. Damage its engine now. You can manage your ships from the ship manage you can ma you can you can manage your ships from the ship manage consoles. You can toggle landing gear with You can toggle landing gear with the N key. When the landing gear is deployed, align the sun and its orbiting planets mm, form solar system. systems. Clusters of multiple solar to summon your ship on planet surfaces, first activate the cursor. Find your ship in the drop-down list by clicking the ship icon in the top right menu. Then summon. After docking each ship two different clubs, you can activate the pursuit mode. You must. You must first act. You must first act. By deactivating the ship's engine, you can make the ship drift into space. Drifting ships are more difficult to. After docking a station. By p a capital ship cannot be operated by a single person. <coughs> that takes the cake. They have guard drones. Watch out. <laughs> No, it is not in here.
Calibration module activated. Calibration completed. Waiting for the thruster input. I can't believe what you just did there. You were great. As promised, I repaired your robot. However, only the B-Drive was operational. This means that only the head of the robot was working. But after all you've done for me, I didn't want to settle for that. I found a very clean robot from the junkyard and uploaded your robot's B-Drive to a newer model droid. As a matter of fact, you will have a new generation multifunctional droid with the brain of your old robot. These SR11 models are very athletic, able to fight and even... 
You know what I mean? Ah, I almost forgot. I collected the ship weapons and to upgrade components for you. I'm sure they're better than the ones loaded on your ship. Thanks again. If you need anything, you know where to find me. This exoskeleton, it is different. It's you. I was an old colleague of your father's. I had promised him I would watch over you and thought I had failed him. But here you stand before me. This is the final boarding call for passengers booked on flight. It's understandable you don't remember me. <coughs> After all, you were just a baby when we parted ways. My designation was three with commander of the WRA. I was the right hand of the great general, your father. This is the final boarding call. Thank you. World Resistance Army. An organization founded by your father. Freedom. For that, I need to start from the beginning. Which brings us to today. Now the responsibility falls onto you to continue what your father started. That is to unite and liberate the entire human race. Your father was no terrorist. He was a great resistance leader. The true terrorists are the current leaders of this galaxy. Do you call living in secrecy freedom? I know how the council of these leaders works. If they were ever to discover your cities, they would slaughter all the earthlings. So tell me, is this really how you want to live? In fear? Dear visitors, this is the pre-boarding announcement for flight 89B to Sega Systems. We are now inviting those passengers... At this time, I see that it is pointless <coughs> to try to convince you. You said you're a freelance pilot, correct? Then I have a job for you. Your father's former second in command, Anchor. He is in prison. I want you to break him out. In return, I will give your father's armor. It is priceless. Of course, I am a man of many... Correction, a woman of many plans now, I suppose. You'll need to travel to the planet Zeda. Specifically the prison district. Take out any of the hostels and free anchor. Great. Let's discuss the details then. Nirax, a world organization leader, has devised a prison rape plan. <coughs> you will need to join this raid and extract anchor before the prison is destroyed. What is the date today? We are still 50 moons away, but I can move up the schedule. No issues there. Every worldly organization is loyal, and will follow your father's and Admiral's orders. We have plenty of time should you need it. I would recommend you use this free time wisely. There are various guilds throughout the galaxy that you can join. By becoming a member, you can gain experience and reap the unique benefits offered by each guild. There is a guild section in the main interface. There you can find the location of the closest branch of each guild. I would suggest joining the Freelancers Guild first. The types of missions they offer will enhance your piloting skills, and this will in turn allow you to equip higher tier upgrades. The choice is of course yours to make. 
If you don't mind, I would like to join your crew. As a co-pilot, I bring many years of experience that will be of benefit to you. Wise choice. As a co-pilot, my first advice would be to upgrade your weapons. Smen's weapons are in should be better than what you currently are using. It would be wise to equip them before we encounter any further hostiles. Let's be on our way then. Oh yeah? Well, I feel like this is a great way to end off this episode here, guys. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. If you end up liking this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave a comment down below. And also check out my other social medias. Till next time, Stretch420 out. Peace. Oh.